Hello YouTube, this is Hot Fuzz, aka the UND Collector, with another video for you of my collection. Today I'd like to show you some of my recent PS Vita games um, that I've acquired over the last few weeks. Um, just got the excellent The Walking Dead, the complete first season. Um, this is a US release. Um, really good game actually, I never got a chance to play it on the Xbox 360 or the PS3. Um, but it's a really, really good title. Um, and it's based on the original um, Walking Dead comics. Um, and the, the, the animation and the graphic style in, in the game is, is brilliant, it's amazing. Um, and it really keeps you uh, hooked. I've played through the, one of the first scenarios episode one and I'm really really happy with the game um, looking forward to playing a few more episodes this week and um, there's loads of uh, trophies to unlock um, and I think I've unlocked about nine or ten already um, so looking forward to playing the rest of this game really really good game and it even comes with the original uh, 400 days DLC which was actually a, an extra um, episode and that was only available on Xbox 360 and PS3, but now this comes included on 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 the the actual the PS Vita cart. So that's The Walking Dead. Um, I picked up uh, Harry Potter uh, five to seven um, for the PS Vita because it was on sale in Asda for ten pounds, um, which I thought was a cracking deal. So I thought I'd pick that up. I've been looking online at this game, and it sort of retails between. Um, average 15 pounds and 20 quid so I thought for for 10 pounds good good value um, I'm not a massive fan of Harry Potter but the Lego games are really cool it's a shame they didn't actually bring out um, Harry Potter years 1 to 4 um, for the PS Vita maybe that will come later who knows um, we might not even get it I know it came out for the PSP and uh, for some of the other consoles, but for some reason it just missed the PS Vita. It could just have been uh, the timing factor. So that's Harry Potter 5 to 7. Another really good game, uh, side scrolling beat em up, um, Batman uh, Arkham Origin Blackgate. Um, played this um, for about half an hour the other night uh, when I was on my break at work, and I actually couldn't get past the first. Um, mission where you've got to sort of have a fight with uh, Catwoman um, so I'm going to have another go at that see if I can uh, see if I can beat her I, w I was tired though so that's maybe the reason why I, I, I couldn't get the moves right so that's um, that's the Batman game then we've got Spy Hunter um, it's actually quite a good game this uh, it had some bad reviews on the internet but I never sort of try and uh, take on board reviews really as you know I prefer to sort of play games myself unless it's a top top title and, uh, and then I do rely heavily on, on reviews on the, on the internet but it's a pretty understated uh, racing game uh, and sort of slight um, shoot them up really in a way um, very very similar to uh, full uh, uh, full auto battle lines for the PSP very very similar game to that in the sense that you have like gadgets attached to your car and uh, you can blow shit up so there you go Spy Hunter and a um, game that I acquired over the last few weeks I did have the Japanese version of this but this is actually a um, Chinese region coded PS Vita game as you can see it's all in Chinese on the cover but it's actually in English on the cart so it's got full English on the cart um, this was actually released in the US as well with slightly different cover um, but I actually prefer this version believe it or not I actually prefer the art on it so yeah pick that one up off eBay I think I paid about £20 for that one and then lastly we've got um, the Marvel Heroes uh, Universe in Peril um, big box uh, limited edition um, this is this box here and you can see it's quite huge got the game there and then you've got this really cool playset which I won't be opening uh, as much as I do love Lego um, and you've got Iron Man versus the Mandarin Ultimate Showdown playset 
looks pretty cool and it's all wrapped up in this really nice big box it's probably the biggest um, limited edition that I've got actually so far uh, it's even bigger than the PSP ones that came out um, just show you what it says on the back there defend the Marvel Universe against the most powerful villains ever assembled there we go that's all the art on the back and that's it that's it, that's my most recent um, Vita games, I will show you a few more of my Vita games um, in the near future I do have quite a few Vita games, I think I've got about 30 plus at the moment there's people on the internet that have got some massive Vita collections um, you know some people have um, got all the, the US and all the English titles already um, I've just been picking up titles as I've gone along and games that I want to play really to be honest with you like I did with the PSP so thank you for watching um, this is Hot Fuzz signing out um, Make sure to call back and have a look at my videos, see if there's any more new videos uh, uploaded. Thank you very much for watching.